the last 23 years, it has been my wife and I and our sons divine privilege from God to serve the Lord as missionaries to Bangladesh and India. And I can tell you today that we are seeing God do tremendous things. What started with five or six of us in our apartment building in the capital city called Dhaka, Bangladesh, is now well over 19,500 Jesus name Holy Ghost filled believers in the church in Bangladesh today. Fifty one point eight per cent of the nation's population are under the age of twenty four. So we started a youth service on Thursdays with only five to six people, and now for today I could say I've seen hundreds of people receiving the Holy Ghost and baptized in Jesus' name from our youth camps and our youth services and God is really revolutionizing the lives of the youth in Bangladesh and India. Several years ago, the Lord allowed my wife and I and our son to travel to Agra, India. Now today, there are over 55 churches and preaching points and cell groups in the Agra, India area. The Lord has also allowed my family and I the wonderful opportunity of working with the ministry in Calcutta, India. We have seen thousands filled with the Holy Ghost in Calcutta, India in a series of tremendous crusades that we have been able to be a part of working with the churches there in Calcutta, India. In the nation of Bangladesh, the Lord has been moving in a tremendous way. In several of our open air crusades, we have seen thousands receive the baptism of the Holy Ghost. In one crusade, we saw over 1,500 filled with the baptism of the Holy Ghost. About 20 miles away from where we had the previous crusade, in one night we saw over 7,000 people flood the crusade ground. There was a tremendous presence of the Lord there. And in about 20 minutes, we saw over 2,000 filled with the baptism of the Holy Ghost, speaking in other tongues for the very first time. We are believing God for a million soul revival in Bangladesh alone. It is estimated that by the year 2050, the population of India is set to grow to around 1.62 billion people. And I'm believing God for over a million soul revival in India as well. I want to give hope to the homeless. I want to give hope to the needy. I want to give hope to those who don't know God. These are the people that I want to give hope to. What if they knew Jesus? What if they knew the Savior? What if their lives had been made different by the power of the name of Jesus because someone reached them before it was too late? What if we can reach them? What if we are able to travel to that village that has never heard the gospel of Jesus Christ?
We have been privileged in this last term as missionaries with the United Pentecostal Church to establish the Reverend Guy E. Rome Memorial School of Evangelism in partnership with Purpose Institute. We thank God for the 38 students that we have been able to graduate who are now working for the Lord in the ministry, both in Bangladesh and India. Will you partner with us for $50 a month to help support a Bible college student to learn the Word of God and be sent forth into the harvest of the Lord. Currently, there are 116 churches all over the nation of Bangladesh with approximately 20 buildings that house the sanctuary of the Lord where hundreds of thousands of people worship the Lord. We are in need of churches today. You can answer the what if question for country churches by giving $6,000 to build a brick and concrete church for about 150 people to worship the Lord in. Would you answer with us today the what if question also for our headquarters and Bible school permanent building? You can sponsor one room in the Bible college for approximately $5,000. Would you answer the what if question by giving $5,000 today? Thank you for giving. Thank you for partnering with us. Thank you for praying. And thank you for answering the what if question for eternity in Jesus' name.